Hey guys, this is Lucas the Boss here with another project with Blue Mullet, which is a bow pup, bolt action, slide action, repeating swing shot. I need to come up with some better names. I'm so original. So here it is. This thing is a very complicated gun. So there's probably better. Not better, but more complicated stuff out there. But this is on up there with my fully automatic gun. But the bad parts of this is that the bolt sticks out the back whenever it's pulled. If I can get this back, Let's see how that sticks out the back. But that's one of the bad parts to the gun. Um, that's really the only bad part, other than the fact that. Whenever this bolt's pulled all the way back, the actual part that pushes the bullet forward is a one-way thick, and part of that sticks out of the back of the gun. So it's not very sturdy, and could be very frustrating to deal with, but I just use it just to shoot, but it would take a lot of changes to make this into a war-worthy connection, but I will paneling stuff. There's the crossbow arm, something special. There's the slot. I had to put this as a blue rod instead of a yellow connector because the rubber band seems to slide better to lock onto the trigger. Right. So, here's the magazine. Shoots, uh, There's the marrow. That's a pretty that's a decent looking gun. I'm not sure if I like this little angled curve or not. I'm gonna start trying to build guns with better looking connections from the handle to the stock. Or just get rid of this all in itself and find a different thing that as me because this is what I think I'm throwing a lot of my guns but um yeah nothing too special as far as the looks go it's just the concept in itself it's so ridiculously uh I'm bored of my kind of um complicated yet sort of simple I'll give you some background knowledge too on this uh Blue Mullet had a Nerf gun that used a concept almost exact to this. That's kind of what we named it after, uh, or that's what we did it after. It's called his cross pop. No, that's why he called it his connection gun, but not too long ago. Cross bolt, I think that's what it's called. But here's the trigger. You can see how yeah, that comes down. And whenever the rubber band comes back and pushes that back, it locks into place, but I will stop running my mouth and I will try and show you guys the shooting. So I've got three shots in the magazine, which is back here. Um, so I will go ahead and well, I'll try and get back here so I can look just a bit better. So this is a little bit since the bolt comes out the stock. It's kind of challenging to the trigger locks like that. And then all that's left to do is I'll try and get show this. See like how sometimes it's try hard to get this bolt started back in. I don't know if you can see this. But it just drew a bullet out of the map. Sorry about that, my phone like ran out of memory so I had to go through and delete some stuff. But right when it cut off. It was at this stage, the bullets in the chamber and the 
Rubber band is pulled back and latched and it's ready to fire. All we gotta do is just shoot it. As you can hear, it hits pretty hard. Um, the loading, like just pulling it back and cocking it, takes quite a while. It isn't that efficient. But just the concept in itself is what we were trying to get. So it's probably much easier to, like it's probably really easy to make it to where it just and you're ready. But with this gun, it requires so much attention to certain things that that's nearly impossible. But I will cut the video on the reloads and I will get you some different camera angles. So I've got another shot loaded and a different camera angle. So I hope you guys can see this. I got another camera in for you guys and another shot loaded. So that's about it for this uh, for this video, guys. Um, war weapon, no. Nope. Even efficient, no. Nope. But it's it's new and it's fresh and it's something that we need in this new connect and this not new but connects community. Um, just like when the pin guns first bikes came out they were okay they weren't great and just really bad honestly but this is the way these are starting out i think that if we just get more people building with this style we can get more advances in technology and we can create a war weapon that will even surpass uh the weapon for another creation might be in blue bullet but more probably him than me but we both worked on it but i hope you guys enjoyed the video uh consider liking it if you enjoyed it and just i want to see more people try a gun like this they're not that hard um and if i can build it it ain't that hard but i just i really want to see this being done more and for long, pin guns are just going to be a thing of the past. If this is... Pin guns will never go away, but it's just something new. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and have a nice day, guys.